In this video I'm just going to have a little talk about CTs or current transformers. This particular CT you see here is a uh, 400 ampere primary rated to 5 ampere, yeah. 400 to 5. That means 400 ampere goes through the actual CT and it gives 5 ampere to the meter. The CT is rated at 5 VA for volt ampere. Class 3, so it's not a very accurate CT, 3% error. Often you can get hold of quite nice ammeters, but they're usually scaled wrong or they rated for 5 ampere. In general, they were CT meters, but um, you can easily convert them to make them useful for your electrical experiments for uh, YouTube videos with high currents, like I've done in this particular meter. This meter goes up to 600 ampere. But the actual scale is set for 400 to 5, which is marked on the back of the meter. Nameplate ratings are often marked either on the back of the meter or on the nameplate at the font itself. Like on this English electric meter 200 to 5 ampere, that means a reading of 200 ampere on the scale gives 5 ampere output from the CT. Say so in this particular case I want to measure 20 or 30 ampere with a 5M meter. So what I've done in this setup, I've uh, used a 400 to 5 ampere CT and I put uh, 10 turns. This is going to be my primary call. So if I put up to 40 ampere through this bar, 40 ampere gets 5M to the meter. That means the meter will read 400 in this particular case, when 40 ampere goes through that call of bound, but then the reading is scaled by a factor of 0.1 which equals 40 ampere. The meter can still be used for 400 ampere as well by basically putting one turn of thick gauge cable through there. Use that as your primary and then the secondary output is from the CT terminals uh, which goes straight into the ammeter itself. This meter I'll be using in my next VT experiments. As you saw in my previous video, I had two 5 ampere meters in uh, parallel and the dial still flew off the scale as their capacity was maybe up to say 15 amps. So yeah, that will, uh, this thing will be used very shortly. Here we get a 1000 ampere CT. Um, they often got a primary and secondary, which is really only important for uh, measuring this kilowatt hour meters, but for M meters it doesn't really matter. This meter, for example, is rated, well it goes up to 600, but the scale says uh, 400 to 5 ampere. So this meter will be perfectly matched with uh, one of the 400 ampere CTs, which I have here. So if I connect that one up, this will be perfectly scaled to this meter as well. Some CTs are multi-tap. This particular one is labeled 4321. Basically this one comes out of a uh, 33,000 volt circuit breaker. It is, has a common terminal 150, 300 and 600 ampere. Quite a big one, but uh, it will do exactly the same. It can also be used at normal 240 volt mains voltages. Um, yeah, put in any questions, but uh, there are some nice ammeters out there, either on uh, eBay or you get them for work, and uh, they certainly have another use of useful life for electrical experiments. Thanks for watching.